What's up? Was that Inspecto? Inspe Inspeco? Dude, I'm sorry if I'm saying that wrong. <laughs> How you doing? How you doing? That is amazing. Let's just hit the button and everyone starts coming in here again. How's it going? I got a really sweet, uh, really sweet lesson for you guys. I just finished, I got out of the gym, just, just barely, actually, just barely. I've been doing, uh, have you guys ever done Body Beast? Holy crap, that is hard. <laughs> I don't sell that stuff, I don't do any of that stuff, I just, I just do the workout, and my gosh, it is so hard. But I've gained like five pounds of muscle in the last like, uh, like six, six weeks, so it's been fun. The wife likes it for sure, she's a fan. <laughs> Anyways, hey, I got something really cool to share with you guys today. How many of you guys, give me some hearts if you guys are like selling something right now, if you're like selling, um, whether you're, you have your own business, you have your own product, um, give me some taps, give me some little, give me some love, and I gotta know, because I don't even know who I'm talking to real quick. How many guys, how many guys are actually selling stuff online? Anyone? Bought something online? <laughs> hey, I got a really cool story for you though today, because I've been, um, I, I've been selling stuff for, you are? Who is it? That's awesome. Where are you from? I'm trying to read your name, I'm sorry. Taiva? <laughs> it's cool for raising your hand. What are you selling? What are you doing? Because I bet what you're doing, you could actually uh, um, sell a byproduct. Um, so I, um, this works for anything. I guarantee you're from Kazakhstan. Holy crap, that's awesome. Kazakhstan, that's awesome. I'm gonna have to go there someday. But uh, so anyways, I, I actually, um, I've been doing internet marketing for a while, but I didn't start that way. I didn't mean to do that, right? I was actually uh, just building some websites, just tinkering around with it. I didn't know how to build websites. It was actually just on WordPress, right? And then all of a sudden, um, I was like, crap, I can't, nobody can see my stuff. And so I started learning how to drive traffic. Well, lo and behold, I actually started getting really good at it. And we'd get, you know, 50,000 people in a few days to these sites. And uh, like, it was actually for an MLM that I'm in. I'm not, not going to talk about it or anything like that. But I just, it was for something that I was in. I was trying to get leads, and we got like 100 leads in two days, and I was like, holy crap, and it turned out I was actually really, really good at sending traffic and getting leads, right? And so, um, for those of you who just came on, sorry, I'm super sweaty, I just got out of the gym, I'm, I'm dying, it was rough, it was a hard one today, um, the, meat, the, weight, the weights were mean, <laughs> um, but anyways, it was super cool, hand me an ass so I do bracelets, jewelry, sell them on the internet, hey, that's awesome, that's really cool. That's super good stuff. You sell like Etsy or anything like that, or you got your own sales funnel going on. Um, anyways, uh, so I, it's really interesting because you can always sell your byproduct. I don't know if you've ever read the book Rework. Rework is one of my favorite books of all time because they go in there and they say, sell your byproducts, sell your byproducts. The things that you're doing right now are producing something on the side that you're not even aware of usually. So ask yourself like, hey, what is it that I'm actually doing right now that actually could... Uh, um, that I could sell. And so I've done that several times now. Um, in high school, I was a big kid, all right? I was, uh, <laughs> I lost 45 pounds my senior year, or my junior year, and I became like this workout fiend, right? I had a double chin, it was nice. I even had a little triple chin going on, it was real good. This is, this is, this is not good. <laughs> but uh, I, it was funny because I actually, I lost 45 pounds, and then the byproduct of that, though, is I actually got really fast at running. And I went on into, and did a sprint triathlon and got third in the Loveland, Colorado sprint tri triathlon. And it was really cool. But that was a byproduct I wasn't counting on. Like right now, whatever it is you're doing right now is a byproduct. And so figure out what that is. Does that make sense? Do you teach business or what? Um, I do internet marketing. Right now, I have a product. Whew, I haven't told anyone about it, all right? So... <laughs> um, I'll, you know what? Follow me and you'll know like in the next week. You'll see it's about to come out. I'm really excited. But it teaches people how to build sales funnels and, and drive traffic. Um, in my internet marketing classes in college, these guys had no idea what they're talking about. That is not how you drive. Like Google PPC ads, I hate Google. All right, I hate Google. I don't like buying ads from them. I was doing, um, I've done a lot of freelancing mostly. And Paul Mitchell hired me, like the Paul Mitchell, to go do uh, traffic generation for him for their website. And I was really pumped. It was my buddy and I at the time. Now it's just me. He wanted to go do something else. And um, we were over there, and we were driving traffic for him. I don't even know why I'm telling you this story. But we were driving traffic for these guys, and <laughs> we were like, hey, just to show you what we can do, just before we meet with you guys tonight, 
let's just take you know um, uh, some money and, and I want you guys to see how much traffic we can drive for you by the time we get there. And so we did. And by the time we got to the Paul Mitchell store where we were meeting the owners, um, we had, it was just like an extra 150 people. But the keywords would have cost us $1,500 in Google, and we got it for $15. And uh, we could, like, you guys can bet, like, I'm, I'm totally going to confirm your suspicion right now that there are inner circles, inner loops inside the internet. The internet runs off of advertising, so you can bet there are inner circles, because there are. And, and I met some of these guys, and they started teaching me how to do it. So, anyways, um, but some, there's been some cool byproducts of that, some cool byproducts of uh, working for them, of working for... Um, uh, you know, like I'll get going on something and realize, you know what, I'm not so good at what I'm trying to go for right now, but what I'm trying to do, like what's requiring me to go after this main product, I'm actually really good at this over here, so I'll go over there and work, start working on this. Um, I have a buddy, he's just starting to get into, um, he's just starting to get into web traffic and things like that, and, and the, the, the guy's lost in the sauce, he has no idea what he's doing, uh, but I keep telling him, like, just start, just pursue. Um, you look like Orlando Bloom. <laughs> well, I guess that's good. <laughs> Is that a comment? Give me some loving for that, right? Give me some hearts. Orlando Bloom. That's funny. That's really funny. I saw a video with him after Lord of the Rings, and he had like this pink mohawk, and he was, he was like bungee jumping out of a helicopter. I would like to do that, so I don't know. Maybe if we don't look alike, I think, then we do similar things, but that, that's really funny. Um, no, but that's the whole thing. Guys, that's all I really want to talk about uh, today. I have to get going here soon, but uh, figure out what your byproducts are. Figure out what they are. Get out there and then start selling them. Um, when I was just starting college, um, uh, that was like seven years ago, eight years ago, um, when I first started it, my brother and I just did like a little landscaping business. We just wanted to make a little extra money, but there were byproducts that came from that. I, f I realized, holy crap. I know how to write flyers, right? Um, when I went and, like I said, started building websites, I realized, dude, holy crap, nobody's seeing my websites, I gotta learn how to drive traffic. But then I realized I'm way better driving traffic than I am at actually building websites. And then as I started driving traffic, I was like, I gotta build sales funnels to leverage the traffic as they move through my website. Now I'm way better at building sales funnels than I am even driving traffic, but no one knows how to do either, so I teach both. <laughs> um, but anyways, guys, that's all I really wanted to talk about. Uh, give me some hearts. Give me some loving if you can. I would love that. That means a lot to me. It lets me know that uh, you at least liked it. Um, I, I get on here every day and just show, share something that I've been doing. I want to share my, my computer screen with you and start showing you guys some of the stuff. Because Google PPC, that's good stuff, but it's like the Lexus of PPC uh, AdWords and stuff. You don't need it. There's a billion other search engines out there. Um, here's, a, here's a freebie. Jump into some free chicken. I like free chicken. Jump out there to 7Search. Uh, 7Search.com. It's seven search engines blocked all together in one platform, and you can buy ads on all of them. They're like five cents a click. Okay, they're super cheap. Um, that's a good place to test traffic, all right? Depending on the product, depending on what you're doing, that's a good place. I, I just go test it there and see they don't even want this thing that I'm putting together, you know? And, and if people start biting, then I'll actually jump out there and actually start uh, buying more ads and things like that. But anyways, you guys got any questions or anything like that? We got people from Kazakhstan, that's awesome. We got people from uh, around, uh, I guess maybe around the world, I don't know. Um, but anyways, uh, follow me. I'd like to keep sharing this stuff with you. This is like my fifth, sixth Periscope now. I've never really shared many of these strategies, but I'll show you how to hijack traffic. You probably didn't know you can do, you can do that. That's actually totally 100% legit. It's legal, you're good to do it. People don't know you can do that stuff though. You can hijack traffic. You can follow people around the internet. A lot of people do know that, but anyways. Um, Jump out, uh, jump out there and just follow me and uh, share me if you don't mind. And I'd like to just start sharing some of these strategies because they are the inner deep dark secrets of the internet, all right? These, these inner circles started teaching me stuff and I was like, holy crap, this is legit. So anyways, guys, I will talk to you later. Um, I got to get back to my wife and two little baby girls. Um, and because uh, Papa Sweaty, I got to go, go take a shower now. 